Hey, what's up? Jigs are here. Encountering issues with Valorant not starting or opening on your Windows system? In this video, I will walk you through a series of troubleshooting steps to help you resolve the problem and get back into the game. Let's go. If Valorant isn't starting or opening on your Windows computer, it can be due to various reasons ranging from software conflicts, outdated drivers, issues with the game files, to more complex system incompatibilities. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to troubleshoot and potentially fix the issue. First, verify if the issue is related to server problems. You can check the official Valorant website or the Riot Games support account for updates. See if Valorant servers are running or if there's some maintenance going on. If it's the latter case, then most likely this is the reason why Valorant isn't opening. Once the maintenance is done, the game will launch without any hindrance. Another method is to run Valorant with administrative privileges. To do this, right-click on the Valorant shortcut or the executable file. From the context menu, select Run as Administrator. If prompted, confirm any request to allow the game to have administrative privileges. This ensures that Valorant runs with the necessary permissions. Check also for Windows updates. Regularly update your system to improve security and performance. On your settings, go to Windows Update. Click on Check for Updates and install any available updates. The next method is to update your graphics card drivers either through the Windows Device Manager or by downloading the latest drivers directly from the manufacturer's website. Tap on Display Adapters, Update Driver, and Search Automatically. By keeping your drivers up to date, you ensure that your system can take full advantage of your graphics card's capabilities. Close the background applications, especially those that use the internet or overlay features, can interfere with Valorant. Use the Task Manager to close unnecessary applications by pressing Control plus Shift plus Escape. Then right-click the application you want to end its task. Disabling full screen optimizations can sometimes resolve the problem. Full screen optimization is a feature introduced to improve gaming performance and reduce input lag by optimizing how applications run in full screen mode. However, it can sometimes cause compatibility issues with certain games or applications. To disable it, right click on the Valorant executable or shortcut and select properties. Go to the compatibility tab. Check disable full screen optimizations, then click apply and OK. You can also use the Riot Client to repair Valorant's game files. To do this, open the Riot Client. Navigate to Valorant and click on the profile icon, then tap on Settings. Select Repair and wait for the process to complete. Uninstalling and then reinstalling both Valorant and its anti-cheat software, Riot Vanguard, can resolve issues caused by corrupt installations. From the control panel, uninstall Valorant and Riot Vanguard by following the steps on the screen. After the process, restart your computer. Download the latest version of Valorant from the official website playvalorant.com. Tap Play Free. Download and then install it. If none of the above solutions work, contact Riot Games support for further assistance. Be ready to provide them with details about your issue, system specifications, and any error messages you've encountered. Remember, troubleshooting software issues can be a process of elimination, so it might take several steps to find the solution. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.